guys, in this video I have both of my dogs with me. The big one is Molly and then the little miniature schnauzer, this is Chloe. Um, and the reason that they are both in my video today, well, Molly is walking off, but the reason they're both going to be in my video today is I am going to share with you a new product and then also do a little review and demonstration of how our little puppies like it. So the product is called an Aura Pup. And Chloe already knows what this is since we tried it, so she's already excited for it. Um, but you don't get it yet. Um, so basically what this is, is it helps eliminate kind of the bad breath and bacteria in a dog's mouth without having to brush their teeth. Um, I am in the vet industry, so I do take good care of their oral health because it's actually the number one disease in dogs over one years old. Um, so it's something that affects all dogs and actually with Chloe she eats a dental kibble as her normal food. Um, it's about this size kibble and she only gets 10 of them because they're so big but yeah it forces her to actually bite into it instead of just swallowing the kibble whole. So it adds a little bit of mechanical scrubbing on her teeth. Anyways but I do brush their teeth Technically you should brush them about three times a week. I don't because it's very time consuming and neither of them like it. And with Chloe to get her to brush her teeth I have to like pull her cheek open to get in the toothbrush. Like yeah anyway it's just like and she hates it. She really hates it. Um, so it's not a fun time and then I have to follow it up with a whole bunch of treats to try to make it a positive experience. Anyways, so now this product, the Oropup, is really cool. So you put about half a teaspoon of the Oropup Lickies onto the brush and this, it has kind of anti-plaque and it has natural bad breath fighting enzymes and it is in beef and bacon flavor. So they love it and they love this because of it. Um, and then you just let them lick it themselves and just like how we would use like a uh, tongue scraper, it just gets all of that bad bacteria off their tongue but they're doing it themselves without even realizing it. So I got a box in the mail that included two of these kits. This is it all packaged up. And then I opened this one and this is what's inside. And then also I got um, the Aura brush, which is for humans. This one's not for you, Molly. For humans, and I'm super excited to try this because I'm obsessed with my oral care as well and I have a tooth or a tongue scraper, um, but I'm curious to try this one because mine is just like plain plastic and it's weird shaped. So, very excited to try these as well. But back to the dog. So it comes in a pack like this and they have five different colors. Um, I just got a random color, I didn't really care. So it says, it says right here, you can beat Brad doggy breath without a tooth toothbrush without having to you know brush their teeth three times a week or however many times you need to um, and the nice thing what I really like about this is Chloe my little one she will eat absolutely anything anything she finds outside she will eat and we go to the off-leash park a lot and she'll eat other dogs poop and she'll eat deer poop she'll eat worms uh, like everything she'll eat everything um, and then she gets all excited to see me and wants to lick all over my face and it's like no, your beard is brown. I know where you've been. You are not licking me. And then usually I whip out my toothbrush, but I have no hope of trying to brush her tongue. I can brush her teeth. Again, she doesn't like it. But yeah, no, I cannot brush her tongue at all because, I mean, she's not going to stick it out voluntarily for me. So on the back, it kind of has some information. So it has micro pointed bristles um, and they're kind of ultra soft. And then it also has a built in tongue scraper. Um, this has three of them so you can kind of see these horizontal lines here those are the tongue scrapers and then all along there we go it has kind of all these little bristles which is going to scrape the bacteria off of the dog's tongue so what happens when they um, lick it it kind of these little bristles loosen the bacteria and then the bigger ones that are more firm they actually like scrape it off of the dog's tongue um, and then when you're done usually they say about a minute um, for the dog should lick it you just run it under the tap and it all comes off and yeah no problems at all and because of the bacon and beef flavor they actually want to lick it like it's not something you have to force them to do <laughs> that's awful like yeah even just me taking these out Chloe was extremely interested in them again because she knows what it's like and then it also just helps build up their dog's oral health because you're taking the bacteria out, it's just going to be a whole lot cleaner and healthier and when you do have a buildup of bacteria then that's what's going to stick onto the teeth in a bind and then you're going to end up with tartar. Um, so that's why, yeah, this is really good. It gets rid of the bacteria before it has a chance to calcify on the tooth. So I'm going to show you how it is. Chloe, where did you go? Oh, there you are. Oh wait, so what I'm going to do is 
this is what it looks like here and it's very liquidy so I'm not even squeezing it and it's coming out so just kind of watch uh, no that's not the open one anyway so I have it on here like this <gasps> what's that and I'm gonna hold her so but she'll still like it <gasps> what's this So she's so excited and she's like suspended in midair and she's still like, yes, must lick this. Let's have your sister try. Molly, come here. <laughs> Chloe's like, what? Me too. No, you can't actually eat it. It's to lick. Oh wait, you can finish. So there's still a little bit left, so Chloe will happily finish this off. Okay, you'll just be licking this over here. So for the kit like this that has the paddle and then also the little um, bottle of flavored stuff, um, and this they say lasts up to 30 applications. Um, so about a month because they suggest you use it every day. Um, so that is $20. And then if you want, you can get ones that have two of these um, and you can actually choose your colors as well. The first one, you just get a random color. Um, you can get two of these plus, you know, the whole pack and then plus the two human brushes. And that one is $33 usually. But uh, I'm gonna put my link below. It's orapop.com slash christytv300. Um, you can get 25% off. So I'll put that link below and then and so for the one pack, it turns just to $15. For them, for the two pack, it is $25. Um, and they do free shipping in the States, so that's pretty cool as well. And it is a fairly new product, like the dog version of. She's still going at it. Um, but yeah, no, I'm really excited that I heard about it. And that, no, you cannot eat that. Um, and that, yeah, my dogs actually really, really like it. Um, Chloe, she loves everything, but Molly likes it too, and she's more of a picky dog, even though she's like half lab. Um, but it just makes cleaning their mouth so much easier. Um, and like I said, when I brush their teeth, I can't brush their tongue. So any bacteria that's still on their tongue, I'm not going to get. At first when I heard about this, I watched a lot of other people's reviews and they were saying, oh, it's so great. I never have to brush my dog's teeth anymore. And since I do work in the vet industry, I was like, that's not really accurate. I mean, you still do have to. Bacteria, a lot of bacteria is on the tongue, but it is also around the rest of your mouth um, or your dog's mouth. So I was like, why are they saying that? Um, so then Luckily, on the back here, it does say, Oropup does not replace the need to brush your dog's teeth or have regular vet checkups. Um, so that was, I'm really glad that they did put that disclaimer in because a lot of people were saying contradicting things in their reviews. Um, so then I started kind of thinking, uh-oh, but no, I'm happy that, you know, Oropup does say that, you know, it's not replacing tooth brushing, it's just something to help reduce the amount of bacteria um, and something that is so easy that they love. Um, so I, yeah, I love these products. Did you get it all? No, you didn't. So I love the products and you can see my dogs do too. So yes, make sure you check out aurapup.com and I have my little link below to get the 25% off. No, no eating end. Um, and I definitely recommend checking it out. Um, and yeah, it's just, Super easy and a great way to boost your dog's oral health um, without doing anything hard. It's something that they think is a treat, but it's actually working. And this is not something I usually do, voluntarily do, um, to smell my dog's mouth, but... Can I smell? <laughs> yeah, it definitely smells the bacon, bacon and beef. Actually, I smell the bacon the most. <laughs> And I mean, I don't love the taste of bacon, but it's a lot better than smelling like poop or all the other crap that she gets into. And then with the big one, Molly, it's a lot better than just having that really stinky dog breath smell. I would rather smell the smell of bacon than whatever else is going on in their mouth. <laughs> okay, thank you guys so much for watching, and they both say thank you, and we will talk to you guys later. Bye!